Hi, welcome to Romania. How you doing? I'm fine. How are you doing? I'm very good. Yeah, just kind of here, just soaking it up. Um, here with my MC Linguistics, just kind of uh, seeing what's going on in Bucharest, basically. It's your first time here, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, actually, I came quite a while ago, about four years ago. Um, when I won, I think I won an, uh, an MTV Remainer Award for oh. Best Drum and Bass DJ. So I came, they actually flew me here to collect the award or something like that. It was crazy. But I didn't actually play a proper show, so to be here tonight is wicked. Now, you are uh, one of the first and the best uh, DJs of Drum and Bass. Um, what's your opinion on this new trend with Drum and Bass? Because now it's very popular, I mean, very popular. Yeah. Especially in Europe. I think the thing is with drum and bass is that drum and bass as a, a genre, as a music, has always been consistent. And, you know, other styles of music come in, you know, dubstep and trap music and garage music and whatever music, which is all great. Um, but with drum and bass, the thing that is always kind of true to drum and bass is that it stays constant. So it never, it never disappears. It's always there. And it's what happens, you know, kind of other music's kind of disappear and everyone's like, hey, I like drum and bass. And it's like, yeah, drum and bass is still here, you know, so yeah, really good. Um, and I'm just kind of enjoying traveling around and, and playing music and it's just a great, great feeling to be able to do it. Now, from this new wave of DJs, do you have any favorite? Um, sort of more producer wise, um, I'd say people like Rockwell, uh, Metric. Um, Technomatic, guys like that making great, great tunes at the moment. Um, music that's really interesting me and keeping drum and bass very fresh. Now, I'm sure you've been to a lot of parties. Can you remember the craziest one? Um, I won't be able to remember every <laughs> detail of it because, um, you know, it wouldn't have been that crazy a night, you yeah. know, but um, yeah, there's been many of those. Yeah, we, we, we don't really shy away from the craziness. Um, is it hard with this nightlife? Not really, you get used to it. Um, it's, I'm, I'm writing my album at the moment, um, and also I've uh, got a radio show on BBC Radio 1 back home in England, so I do a drum and bass show on there, and that's kind of like daytime work. So I've got quite a lot of daytime stuff, but when it comes to sort of being out in the evening and DJing in a club or a festival and stuff like that, um, I'm used to it, it's easy. Do you have a name for the album yet? Couple of names in my head, but nothing. And do you have any idea when it will be released? Or um, I'll probably say um, early to mid next year, 2014. Um, my next single is called Long Gone Memory, uh, and that is out in September. Uh, the vocals are written by example. Um, and that's a really big song for me. I'm really looking forward for that coming, you know, getting out to the public. And there will be a video also, right? There will be, yeah. Hopefully, I want to see it on MTV Romania. Of course. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> thank you very much. All good, thank you.